we begin by helping the client to give words to um, what it is that they most deeply hope for in therapy. Um, we want to put the client in the driver's seat. We're not following our agenda, but theirs. And it could take more than one session uh, to get clarity about what people really want for themselves. A lot of shame around exposing that. And it's something that we do throughout therapy. Um, we, um, out of respect, we want to inform the client about our approach uh, to see if they understand what we're proposing and how they feel about it. And uh, that involves giving caring attention to our feelings, our bodily sensations, thoughts, and the state of our relationship from moment to moment. This is a wholly new way of relating for just about everyone I've ever had in my office. And a lot of people will feel anxious and uh, intimidated, and we do a lot of work to help them get beyond that. We also do this in an intersubjective way, and that we're also tracking what's going on within ourselves internally, not only the client. We are continually attuning to the client's will to engage in this process. And that will can go on and offline at any time. Uh, once the will is engaged, the, uh, the uh, partnership begins to come online in a very real way. Then we start to invite feelings. It's a focusing related to a specific person and experience. To learn more about our programs or subscribe to our mailing list, visit deftinstitute.com.